Uh, we founded Vietnam Cat Welfare over one year ago, but we started taking rescues on about four years ago. We run Jack's Cat Cafe, which is a sideline of Vietnam Cat Welfare. Um, so we open our shelter every day um, for four hours so the visitors can come and sit and have coffee and cuddle the cats and see all the uh, rescues. Uh, we have today 72 cats, uh, but it changes all the time if we adopt out or we take more rescues. We tend to do a lot more work where we help locals, so if they call us up and say they found a kitten, we'll go to them and we'll educate them how to look after them, how to feed them, where to go, what to do. We've got a couple of cases here that are uh, motorbike accident cats or disabled cats or neonatal babies that need bottle feeding. Basically just rescues, we get a lot of rescue calls every day, um, of dumped, neglected, abused kittens and cats. So we can't take every case on, but we'll take the cases on that no one else can deal with and then we'll rehome them. Um, we've got eight kittens that are all ready for homes. Kittens are easy to rehome, um, so they're ready to go now. So we'll start posting about them and hopefully finding them homes as soon as possible. <laughs> about 20 cats can go to the toilet and use our toilet, the human toilet. Um, so we have a lot of cats that do that. Uh, we didn't actually teach them, one cat did it, and then the other cats just followed. They have their own bathroom in the back of the house, and they use the toilet, and they use the bathtub for number twos, and they use the toilet for number ones. It's a big cat litter tray. So we work, we have jobs, we run jack. So I wake up every morning, 8 o'clock till 11 o'clock cleaning, 11 o'clock till 3 o'clock in the cafe, 3 o'clock till 10 o'clock at night in my job and then I'd come home and clean and feed and get all the cats in until midnight and then go to bed about one o'clock and then it would start all over again. So in the summer, I can't handle it because it's too hot. You, you physically, I did it last year and I physically can't do it again. So I'm taking the six months off to, to and I'll work again in the, in the rainy season and winter here. So if we didn't have jobs, we couldn't, we couldn't physically do it. So we have to work. We um, ask people to sponsor cats um, to donate online. You can easily donate online. And Jack's Cat Cafe helps people, um, people. Buying a coffee, well, the money goes towards the cats. You know, We like volunteers to come all the time, so we help, need help cleaning, feeding, looking after the cats, maintenance in the cafe. We will always fund their lunch and their, everything in the, in the cafe. Um, one month is always good for people to come and come here five days a week. Hoi is beautiful. There's so much to do in Hoi So yeah, we always need we always need volunteers. <laughs>